TitleMatchNetwork.com. Any memories from your feud with Harley Race? No, Harley's a good man. Uh, enjoyed working when we did the Slammy Awards. Uh, old school and the guy that I respect and look up to. When you say you did the Slammy Awards old school, I remember that for a lot of people who might not have seen, you and Harley, I think, just brawled through the through entire... The whole, yeah. the whole show is like, what, like an hour or something, right? right? Yeah. You brawled all Actually, the Actually, we did that the day before. Ah, oh, you didn't know his yeah, day? Well, a... what, 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 any stories from that? Just in the whole... Well, of course, he killed the chicken, you know. We we had, as we, the folks that don't know, we did the, the, the I think it was Best Vocals or something, whoever had the best vocal. Of course, the whole one. But anyway, so uh, Harley is on stage. He pushes me off stage, and uh, it's a live shoot. As soon as he pushes me off stage, boom, it all goes into the tape. And so we fight, you know, through the women's dressing room, through the cafeteria. And you've been in the back, they have a donkey and a llama and chickens. And he picks this chicken up by the neck. <laughs> He's beating me with a chicken. Of course, he kills a chicken. It's a, it's a big, huge deal. Harley killed his chicken. Everybody's all upset. You know, like Harley's like, what the hell, you know? And then, uh, then we ended up in the, the food fight. We had a big, huge food fight. They had, they had a big tuna. I had the tuna by the tail. They beat the hell out of Harley, Harley with the tuna. It was uh, good stuff. Yeah. Was it fun going back to doing that kind of brawling, or just yeah, fun? yeah? That's that's what I am—a brawler. I mean, you have, you know, something. You know, you have your flyers, you have your pretty boys, you have your mask guys, you have your muscle heads, you got your brawlers. That's my deal. I can brawl. What about the whole thing when it was when you became the king and all that? Any memories from that whole run? Um, no, it was it was it was great because I think I became the king of wrestling in my hometown. I'm not positive, but I think it was in Lens Falls, New York, where I beat uh, either Harley or, I'm not even sure, you probably, you know, a lot of folks know wrestling trivia better than I. But uh, yeah, they carried me down, you know, in my hometown and my, made my dad proud. That's my, uh, the only thing I really strive for my dad to get uh, for my career was to make my dad happy. You know? And that, that made him happy. I used to bring him on the road with me. Uh, a lot of the boys know my pop. Knew my pop, he just passed. I think we were supposed to do an autograph or this deal in August, and my pop passed in August. Yeah. Okay, sorry. Um, going uh, going back, looking at the big shows for WWF, anything from like a WrestleMania, any stories from there that stand out to you? Any well, I just saw Bad News Brown not too long ago. We were up in Yellowknife, Northwest Territories, up in Canada, and I worked with News that one. And we had a hell of a match. I mean, boom, boom. Whole nine yards, right? And, but the end, at the end, very end, I beat him. I don't know. He tried to hit me with a chair. I blocked it with a two by four, I think, and I whacked him with a board. But I blown, boom, and I had this big, huge strand of snot hanging all the way down to my knee. And that's all anybody talked about at WrestleMania. They didn't care about the math. But did you see that snot hanging out of the ducks? <laughs> yeah, I remember that. <laughs> yeah, there you go, brother. Yeah. Yeah. How about any of the other pay-per-views, Survivor Series, King of the Ring? Uh, else? WrestleMania three, of course, the big one. You know that that, that uh, you know it was a whole different level. Ninety-three thousand people, Pontiac Silverdome. Yeah, that was a, it. Was a trip, right? No, yeah. was it kind of the same kind of feeling you got working the Superdome, or was it just a whole another level? Yeah, pretty much like the Superdome. Like I said, you know, without my glasses, first three <laughs> rows, they're full. We got a big house. <laughs>